Hey everybody, I'm White Emerald, and today I'm going to be playing something a little bit different for you guys. Um, basically, I've been working on a mod for quite some time now uh, called Velvet Quest. And Velvet Quest is a pretty uh, somewhat large mod. I'm not going to speak too positively about it just yet. I'll let you guys decide whether it's worth me finishing this project or not. Uh, the project is not done, of course. Uh, but this is my first like real test and I thought I'd experience it with you guys and see what you guys think of it while I find the bugs of this mod. Um, to give a summary of the mod, the mod is a sci-fi based, um, it's kind of a sci-fi uh, version of Minecraft. It's not like gritty, it's supposed to be a bit cartoony in the sense of sci-fi. I felt like going too serious wouldn't make sense for Minecraft. If you guys have ever played like uh, the Mario and Luigi Partners in Time game, that's about as gritty as it'll ever get. It's not like Fallout uh, kind of gritty. It's more of a cartoony uh, feel for the uh, for Minecraft. So uh, right off the bat, we're probably going to see a lot of strange things. Um, there's a few stuff to explore, but I'm just going to let the mod do most of the talking. Uh, and I'm just going to try my best not to die. Once I die, the video is over. That's what people like nowadays, I've heard. So I'm going to try and do this without dying. Probably won't end well. So let's go ahead and join this world. Hopefully it's not, like, too laggy because I am recording on a laptop. Yeah, I mean, it's not terrible. Uh, this will have to do, I suppose. So, yeah, I'll write about two things from the mod already occurring. This is, oh, hold on. Something is coming for me. I don't know what that was. Uh, let's just, you know, let's just pretend nothing's happening and just play regular Minecraft, right? Just, uh, yeah, just gonna go ahead and mind my own business, and, uh, ooh, what is this? Is that mine? Did I make that? No, it's a, it's a ship. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and break some stuff. Again, the mod is not finished, so some of the ideas that I had for creating it are not quite set in stone yet. Some of the structures have to have a few updates. But um, I'm just showing off what I have so far. And this is also just for me as well. Uh, I thought while I was um, fixing all the bugs and seeing what I like and don't like, you guys could watch with me. I can embarrass myself. So, hold on. Oh, I'm bad at Minecraft all of a sudden. Okay, I am Steve right now because, um, well, because in the testing phase, you don't really get your own account. So, oh my god, I'm being attacked. Hold on. Hold on. Oh. This is kind of awkward, excuse me. That's one of my mobs trying to kill me. Little eyeball uh, eyeball robots. The IS Orbot is what they're called. Uh, there's maybe another one around here, I think. There's usually about four in groups. Nope, I guess we're good. They come from these structures. Okay, so anyways. Uh, I'm gonna pretend nothing happened and just move on. I'm gonna grab this, and I'm gonna make myself an axe. And I think we're good with that. So... You might have heard, but there's some sound coming from this in here. Uh, if you break this open... Takes a second. There's pigs inside. Uh, and a chest, and in these chests, at least for now, there is a pig spawn egg. Uh, in the future, my plan is to make it where you can actually clone these guys uh, using a special tool, but I have not finished making that tool yet, so the you cannot do that yet. These structures are called capture units, and you will find various different animals inside of them, and you can set them free. Basically, they've been captured by an unknown source, and you are able to set them free simply by breaking the block open, and they'll be free to roam around. Uh, and yeah, those little guys that we just fought... Uh, oh yeah, I forgot that's a new mob I just made. Uh, I'll show you what they do in a minute. Uh, oh, yeah. So there's a few things that's happening right off the bat. So a drop pod has landed. Uh, I don't think I'll have to worry about it, though. So we get sometimes text warnings that uh, certain things are happening. Um, another one has landed. Fantastic. I probably should make them a bit more rare, but like I said, you'll find a few of the bugs and things that I don't like uh, since I haven't fixed them quite yet. Okay, let's go on this pirate ship. Uh, I think I was talking about something before that. Um, yeah, we'll talk to that. We'll see those mobs in a minute. There's some strange villagers wandering around. Um, where should I look? Is it in here? Hold on. Buried treasure. 
Where's the buried treasure? So yeah, those capture units will have animals and they're very important because in this mod, finding wild animals is a bit more rare than regular Minecraft. Oop, hold on, here, here we have something. This is some kind of staircase. Oh, there we go, we got a chest. Uh, finding, yeah, finding vanilla mobs is a bit more rare, so... Oh my god, I already got iron. Hold on, I don't like doing it in this order. This is gonna drive me nuts. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. It's okay. We'll come back here in just a second. I just need to do the things in order. Hold on. Hold on. This is gonna bug me. And that's just because I'm very strange. I need to get my hands on some stone before I grab diamonds. Uh, looks like there's some rabbit uh, capture units over here. That's a new plant. It's a machine. I was probably going to use it for the cloning recipe, but um, that isn't done yet. So for now, they're just an annoying plant, and I'll show you what they do in just a second. Let me just grab some stone. Okay, so what I want to do is get an upgrade, then grab the iron, then make the pick, and then I'll grab the diamond. I'm sorry I'm like this. It just really bugs me when I don't do things in order. Um, It'll just take a second, you know? I'll grab the diamonds and they'll be mine. Uh, hold on. Any coal down here? So I'm probably going to smelt some stuff soon. Um, oh, yeah. This uh, chest here gave me the rabbits. So now I have rabbits and pigs that I can basically make more of. Uh, farming, I, th I, th I figure, you know, farming's a really uh, great part of Minecraft that sometimes isn't taken advantage of. Uh, and I thought that having farming be an essential part of this mod would be really important. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, but I'll get to that in a minute. For now, I'm going to make my upgrade. Beautiful. So I'll just grab the iron from here. Because I'm just really lucky and I got this boat. Oh, there's a regular one. Okay. So like those yellow ones you saw before, these are regular ones that have uh, black guys because they're more like cameras. And these guys don't attack you. They're peaceful. Uh, but they are watching you, so be careful with that. So, acquired hardware... I have a lot of iron, actually. You can kill them if you want, but they don't give you any EXP, so there's not really much of a point. But, um... Yeah, they're they're just kind of a freaky, and they watch everything you do. The ones with yellow eyes uh, attack you, of course. Okay, so now I, can, now I feel comfortable grabbing the diamonds. I'm sorry I'm like this, but I'm going to grab myself a diamond now. Okay, there's a single diamond in here. And we got some gold, too. Okay, there we go. Diamonds. I already did it. I'm just that good at this game. Okay, there we go. Um, so, basically, we have a lot of cool stuff already. The knights get tricky in this mod. See, normally, the only thing you have to worry about are some monsters, but here there's some, there's some crazy stuff that happens at night. This mod is supposed to be trickier than normal Minecraft. It's supposed to be a bit challenging. There's some cool things, of course. These guys are cool, don't worry, they're villagers. Villagers can't be evil. Um, oh, look at this. Look at this. Coal. Um, I'd like a little more iron if I could get it, because iron armor is very useful in this mod. Well, it's, it's pretty much useful always. Oh, here we are. But uh, especially a lot of the enemies at night may require this to even stand a chance. So, oh. So, we're just going to go ahead. Grab our, oh, come on, come on. This is also my first time just playing Survival Minecraft on my channel, isn't it? It is. Um, yeah, I sometimes play Minecraft, but, you know, I, I, I really like modding and programming. So, that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, so we're out of that cave. These guys are peaceful. They're bodyguards. Basically, they fight monsters. Uh, they're just very weak, but you can hire them to protect you and also other mobs. If you have pets, you can actually assign them to follow your pets and keep them safe. Uh, or, I mean, if you want to give them a sort of golem and make a little task force, that's kind of something you can do. Um, but yeah, they're just helpful little guys. Uh, it only takes a single emerald to hire them, and they will follow you. And I haven't completely worked out all the bugs with the assigning them to different people, but that is what I'm going to be working on. Um, I'll figure out a way to do that.
pretty soon. I'm also going to make them a little more rare, because they are fairly common at the moment, as you could see. Uh, they come in small groups of about three, I would say about three each. And, uh, yeah, about like two to three is the average group. Are you good? Are you a neutral? You're a neutral. Okay. And there's some berries over here. I'm going to take these. Okay. Hey there, friend. Um... Yeah, my render distance is really low, and I, it's still kind of buggy. I apologize for that. There's not too much I can do about that uh, in my current state. Hopefully when I actually do make an official uh, version of the mod and actually record it correctly, I'll, have, I'll be in my better computer, and it'll, it'll go much smoother. But at the moment, I'm programming it all on my laptop, so that is why it's very laggy. Okay. Wait, where did I leave my... I should have taken... Oh, I did take the crafting table with me. Okay. So, I have quite a bit of iron. I'm going to start smelting. I have a single piece of coal, though. It's not going to be enough. Um, um, I'm going to start making some armor for myself. That feels like a good idea. I, have a, I don't really have that much food, though. I'm going to I'm gonna chop down some... Oh, a cow. Sorry, Mr. Cow. Oh, crap. There's a drop pod somewhere. There's two of them. Okay. I have a little bit of food, but I also can't cook it. Because I'm using my emerald for something else. Uh, okay. Let me pick a flower. Hey, friend. Uh, yeah, at the moment they don't really they don't really join you if you don't have anything to pay them with. I think they also won't attack you under any circumstance, if I'm correct. Uh, I'm pretty sure if you hit them, they're still okay with you. They're less aggressive than an iron golem. They're more like snow golems, but they but they also uh, don't have range attacks, and they do, do they actually do do damage, so. So they are, in some ways, a bit more useful than iron, than snow golems. Okay. Uh, is it turning night already? It's turning night. Okay, fantastic. I don't have a bed. So I'm just gonna live with it. And uh, we're out already. Let's put some wood in there. Oh, wait. Let's use this wood. Okay. I have enough for some armor. I'll make some pants too. Okay. Uh, the night is upon us. That's nice. Yeah, these plants, they don't do much. Like I said, they're probably going to be used for the recipe to make a cloning device. But at the moment, all that happens is if you touch it, you get nausea. Not fun. Uh, so yeah, just don't touch it at the moment. That's about it. That's probably not going to be enough to finish this either, is it? No. Uh, got quite a bit. We'll use this, it's fine. It's fine. And then let's go ahead and make myself some boots. Okay. Probably should have waited to get one more to get the helmet instead, but oh well. It's night already. Uh, I think in this forest I'm fairly fine. Some biomes are a little more dangerous in my mod than others, but uh, this one's okay. I think. If I remember correctly. I'm pretty sure things will be fine. Is there anything over here? Oh, there's another... Oh, there's a capture unit over here. Let me open this up. Oh, there's sheep in here. Oh, I'm going to kill them all, actually. Sorry. They're going to have to die because... Oh, they're out. Oops. That sometimes happens where, like, it's a little... It's angled wrong and they just kind of come out. I got to fix... That's something I have to fix. Sometimes they just come out. So, yeah. Uh, that was one sheep dead. I'd kill the black one, but... Um... I couldn't make a bed with two different colored wools. Oh, giant mushrooms, by the way. Don't touch these. They'll poison you. Uh, bu bu hey. You must be hurt. Yep, you got hurt by the poison. Oh, there's the other one. I killed... Uh, I killed the black sheep anyway. Why did I do that? Okay, you're dead. They're all hurt by the poison. So... Ooh, creeper. Hello. Oh, man. There's a creeper over there. Okay. Oh, there's something over here. What are you? You're a rabbit. And now you're dead. I'm sorry. I, I I also feel the need to try to get every advancement, so I try to get one of every food. What was that? Okay. Um, where's my stuff? Am I lost already? That that's just great. That's just great. I just want my iron. Um, these are the Eper missiles. Very similar to creepers. 
um, they're not missiles, they're mines. They used to be missiles, now they're just mines. Uh, basically what they do is they sit in one place, they don't follow you, uh, they sit in rivers and they explode on impact. The tricky part about them is that they can sometimes turn invisible. So it just makes traveling through the water a little trickier because you gotta look out for them. And, and yeah, you just gotta be careful, don't run into them. I think that's the drop pod from before, I'm gonna come over here and that's where I was. My render distance- oh, this isn't the one. Uh-oh. Is there anything in here? No. They already left. Uh-oh. That wasn't the one. So... How do I head back? I wonder if my render distance is too low for mobs to spawn. I know that used to be an issue. I don't know if it is now. I don't know if it's still an issue with, like, mobs being unable to spawn. Wait, I think I was here before. Isn't this where I found the sheep? Wait, no, this is where I found the rabbits. Okay, so I know where I am. I'm gonna, I want to raise the render distance a little bit, just in case, because I know F4 and uh, things spawn uh, fairly well. Yeah, it doesn't make much of a difference anyway. Okay, I've got our iron, and exactly 64. And uh, drop pot has landed. Yeah, I guess I'm just really lucky right now, because I don't see anything. Oh, there we go. There's someone, hello. Yeah, regular uh, mobs still spawn. I didn't want to completely remove the vanilla mobs. Obviously, we saw a creeper before, but I just remember that back in the day, like having a mod usually meant that you had to give up some vanilla stuff. But I tried my best to make sure that they don't completely go away. So you still have to deal with the vanilla guys quite a bit. Oh, oh, actually, I do feel bad. I'm sorry. Poor rabbit. Oh, okay, that's a new hostile mob. It's on fire right now. That is the brute fly. It's a, it's a giant fly. Basically, um, they're actually not that tough. What they do is, oh here, they poison you on impact. So when you touch one, it'll poison you. But this one's pretty much really dumb. Oh, oh god, oh god, I'm poisoned. Okay, never mind. Forgot what I said. I'm sorry for calling you dumb. Uh, oh, did I grab my furnace? I didn't grab my furnace because I'm an idiot. Come here. They're not too tough, and I'm dying anyway. Okay, there we go. They're not too tough, they're just a somewhat uh, reoccurring enemy in the overworld. They're kind of annoying. But not that much, you know? I think. I'll let you guys be the judge of that, because I, I don't know too well. There's a lot of bodyguards. I should really lower the amount that can appear. Okay. They might be, I would say they're probably fighting some of the mobs, but it doesn't seem like very much because I don't see any loot around here. Hello, creeper. They don't fight creepers, of course. Because, uh, you know you should never have a mob fight a creeper. Terrible idea. Ooh, that wasn't good. Terrible idea to have mobs fight creepers. Oh, here's our stuff. Okay, I'm just going to pack this and go. I have full iron. I haven't been hit yet. I'm feeling pretty good. I wasn't hit, because the fly doesn't hurt you. The brute fly just poisons you. Which is why they're not that much of a threat. They're just kind of a bit... I mean, they have quite a bit of health, but they're not too deadly. Okay. I'm going to travel across the beach here. I am hurt, though. I'm, oh, because, yeah, because of the poison. But the poison doesn't hurt the, the, the armor, so that's why that isn't damaged at all. Okay, so, let's see, are those, are we friends? Are we good? Oh, by the way, my difficulty is set to normal. I think I'm going to leave it at normal for now. It seems like a good way to test the mod. I've tried it hard, it's actually extremely hard. Oh, here's something. Okay, here's some action. Hello, friends. This, oh, this one kind of, oh, that's not a great place for it to spawn. Oh, you guys are stuck down here. And dead, okay. There's some sheep in here. I'm gonna have to kill them all because I want to make a bed. I'm a greedy man. Hello, sheep. I was supposed to save you, but instead I decided to kill you all. Okay, there we go. And we got ourselves. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave this chest. Oh, I haven't been taking them. Sometimes, at least when I've been testing so far, I like to take the the chests just so I can have them. But I kind of forgot to do that this entire time. 
So good on me. Let's use the sand. And I'm gonna die if I don't eat something soon, so I'm gonna have a little bit of this. And yeah, I know it's raw, but that counts as food in the, uh, in the balanced diet, so I'm an insane person, so I eat all the foods, even if they're raw. Okay, and now I can cook them. Uh, oh, I forgot to grab logs. Is this one swimming? Look at this one swimming over here. Yeah, they sometimes appear under the ocean too. I gotta fix that, fix that with the capture unit. Some of these are not good because they kind of drown all the animals. <laughs> it sounds really messed up, but that's what happens. Okay, oh, die. There we go. Um, okay. The sun is rising though, so I might not, I might not have to be too worried. Uh, there's some shurikens over here. I'm just gonna travel for a bit. There's a few structures that, um, quite useful to live by. When, if we, if we find one specifically, I want to talk about it for a sec, but for now, let's just travel, you know? Let's just travel around the world. Uh, if I found a village, that'd be kind of cool. Village is nice. Let's see here. I think, is this a beach? This is a beach, right? It's a beach. Uh, there is a certain structure that can appear in a beach, but it's very rare to find in a beach. Are you, are you friends? Okay. This is a giant egg. Um, I believe there's a glitch with the, the structure at the moment. There was a mob, but I decided to change uh, what it was, so it doesn't spawn anymore. I think the spawner should be empty. Yeah, it's empty at the moment. Um, yeah, so that's something I had to fix. But uh, this is a structure that will appear. It kind of looks like a Yoshi thing. And you get a few uh, meats. And oh, I got a slingshot. If you get lucky, you can find a slingshot. That's a new weapon type. Let's go ahead and grab the slime while I'm at it. May or may not leave the slime because it might it might be a little too much to let people have slime. But we'll see. Like I said, if you guys could let me know what you guys uh, think of the mod overall, if you think there's some issues with it, you should let me know because I'm I'm still working on it. So I, there's room for improvement. And what biome is this? This is like um, giant tree taiga. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think this is fine. I think this is fine. Oh, the slingshot. It's a new weapon. It's a ranged weapon. You can find it in a few structures and dungeons, and um, you can also craft it. It's very easy to craft. It's a little cheaper than a bow. Of course, um, it's only it's the same amount of sticks. It's like a Y shape, and then you put a string in the middle of it. Uh, that's how you craft it. Of course, um, yeah, it would mean it's pretty cheap. You know, you have to kill like less spiders that way. But the biggest advantage comes in what it uses for ammo, and I'll show you what that is in a second. Basically, instead of having to create arrows, you will basically always have a very secure way to use a weapon. You know, you always have a ranged weapon. With you. It's a very weak, weak weapon. Oh my god! Test it out now. The uh, the ammo for this is actually cobblestone. So if you fire here, it shoots cobblestone. That's enough to kill these things. These things are pretty weak. So a little bit of uh, that will be enough. I think these guys might be a little, little bit too tough for this, though. Let's see. Yeah, they're a little tough. Has a decent amount of knockback, but um, the main point is that you can always have a good supply of ammo. Because uh, cobblestone is pretty common, so. Oh, that this one has animals in it. Maybe I'll let them out. It is sheep, though. I'm killing all the sheep right now. Get out of here. At the moment, I just want to have a good food supply before I really go for, like, trying to save all the animals. I'm just going to kill you all, because you are delicious. Okay, and let's grab some sheep eggs. Okay. Okay, hello there. Uh, what's here? Another capture unit. More guys here, and my sword's broken. Oh, this one has chickens. Cool. Uh, I guess I'll use the axe for now. Come here. This would be enough to kill these guys. That's a, yeah, these are probably the most common enemies you'll find in the mod. There's actually other variants of them that are a bit more rare, uh, as you guys will soon see. I should probably, oh, it's a baby chicken. Um, 
You know what? I don't. I feel bad killing a family. No, I don't. No, I do not. I'll I'll just kill a few of them. I'll let most of them live. I usually don't feel bad about killing animals because you gotta hunt them to live, you know. But in this case, it feels so much worse because they're just trapped in there, and I come come in and kill them. I'm, I'm gonna let them go. I'm just kill that one. Just have a little bit of chicken. Um, I could really use some place to live, but I want to find a good place. Oh, here's some more. Um, you know what? What kind of wood is this? Is this spruce or is this dark? This is spruce. Oh, I'm in a taiga, duh. Uh, I'm gonna break this axe. And then I'm gonna replace it with a stone sword. I have a lot of building material. Honestly, I probably should consider leaving this place just because... Um... Just because, you know, there's not much around here. Oh, there's something ch- Oh, it's coming for me, it's coming. Get over here. Okay. I'm worried about dying, so I might kill myself soon. Okay. Oh, 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 they're coming for me. Oh. Oh, oh boy. One more. There we go. Okay, nice. Chickens. Yeah, the spawn egg thing isn't great because it keeps a lot of space in your inventory. So that's probably why the cloning idea is a lot better. Uh, so you can come back here when you feel more prepared. Of course, it isn't hard to break those things open. It's just um, it doesn't keep up as much. I just wanted there to be like a way for you to like make more animals. Certain mobs should be will be clonable. Probably other ones will not be. I'm thinking probably most vanilla mobs, as long as they aren't like, um, as long as they aren't, how do you say? As long as, as long as they aren't hostile, probably, is what I'm thinking. And then if, it probably will cost EXP experience, yeah? And so, you know, obviously, you, if you, you can't farm the experience, uh, so it's not like you can abuse it. Oh wow, there's some good stuff here. I might live here just for a little bit. Hey there, friend. Okay. I'm gonna use this as my centerpiece. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna cook up some fish real quick. I might sleep there most of the night. We haven't been able to do too much so far. Um, let's go ahead. I'm gonna step out for a sec. There's not really much around here. It was just, uh, I like the site because there was iron and stuff, but there's not really anything useful besides that. Oh, it's a spider. I'm gonna kill it. Come here. Come here, mister. Time for you. Uh, it's good kill a lot. Oh, a sheep. Where's the spider? Oh, it was protecting the sheep. Oh, well. Dead spider. Very, very bad job of protecting, by the way. Is that a fly? Yeah, oh, yeah, there's blue flies. Okay, this time I have armor, so you're not going to last a second. Fortunately, these guys at the moment don't attack roof flies, so I might want to fix that, but I'm not quite sure. Ow! Why? Okay. Oh, there's wolves in this one! Okay, so a very rare chance is you can actually find a capture unit with wolves, so I'm going to get myself some doggies. Hi. Oh, they're not in here. Well, they escaped the little hole. Wow. Hold on, let me get, let you guys out. Okay, there you go. No more water. Be free. Oh, it's a heavy one. See, I told you there's other variants. This is a heavy. It's slower, but it has higher defenses, so it's going to take two hits. And it has a chance to drop the uh, IS Corbot chip frame, which will be used for something in a little bit. Okay. Let's go ahead and just head back to our little base. I know I haven't hired any of these guys, but I'm hoping they'll still kind of protect the area. Oh, oh, ow. Okay, wonderful. Uh, why is it light here? The fish. Oh, go ahead and cook up my meat as well. Thank you. Can I open this? Okay. Um, I have bones. I'm gonna try to tame a dog. Let's try it. Let's hope this works. Be my friend, please. Yes, we have a doggy. Okay. You'll be good, dog. Okay. 
So with that, we have... They weren't asleep. They weren't asleep for now. And then... And then I'm going to leave what I don't really need. And then I'm going to head out. Alright, there we go. That's weird. Hold on. Did I leave the game at some point? It's strange. It didn't keep track of all the other things I did. Oh, well. Whatever. Where's my... Oh, there's my bed. Dog. Okay, we're gonna take the lapis, of course. The diamond, absolutely. The gold, the iron, the spawn egg, so I can start my little farm. Uh, the pickaxe. Not you. Know, the pickaxe. The slime. The sand. The wood. The mushrooms. Probably the spruce to make some trees. Leather, sticks, and sugar cane. I'll probably leave the rest. Um, I'm going to build with this so it won't last very long. The axe is going to break any second. It might even break now. Why did I do Oh my god, why did I do that for? I'm so used to just taking the whole box with me. Hold on, I'm going to leave all the junk again. I don't want to bring the flowers. I don't really need them. And yeah, everything else can stay. Oh wait, I don't really want the wool either. Because we're going we're gonna to produce that stuff pretty fast. Here's a new mob. It's a bit of a, just a reskin. But it's uh, it's a blue cow. And these ones are sick. And, oh, a ravine. And, 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 hold on. Is that even close? No. Uh, these guys do something special, but I'm probably not going to mess with it until later because I don't have the equipment to do so. Oh, I'm hungry. Ooh, indeed, sir. Okay. Ooh, what's over here? Hello, Mr. Cow. I'd kill you, but um, I don't have the inventory for it, so you're lucky. I'm going to eat this fish. That actually will give me some inventory space. Okay, let's keep going for now. Just want to find something of use, some place where I could live. Uh, if not, I'll just spend the night in the middle in the open again. Oh, here's somebody. Uh, another type of villager that I created. Uh, they don't have a nose, so they're very strange. But those are the conspiracy theorists. And uh, I can't do much of them yet because I don't have any of the stuff they want, but um, they're useful. Uh, and these guys do appear in villages as well, but I just thought that it would be nice to find them outside of villages as well and get out of here. I've gotten so much experience just killing these little guys. Okay. Yes, chicken, chicken. Okay. Uh, I really want this wood. It's so frustrating I can't grab this wood. I like having uh, a little bit of each of the woods so I can, like, you know, build whatever I want. Uh, excuse the sticks. Sorry. I like having all the crafting recipes as well. I'm a bit strange when it comes to Minecraft. I always like to have everything possible. I want things to go as perfectly as possible. What's over here? A little forest. Probably not going to be a village around here. Okay. Careful with the mushrooms, friend. Don't touch them. If so, though, I can probably heal him with meat. Okay, we're going to climb the mountain. Oh, with some sugar cane over here. I want that. And, oh, more clay. Ooh, coal. Do I have coal right now? I do, so I might as well. Might as well grab it. Don't have cobblestone, though, so that's not going to fit. Which also means that my uh, slingshot is kind of useless at the moment. Did that take care of it? That took care of it. Uh, okay. Give it to me. Give me the clay ball. I thought it would come to me. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this. So much coal. This will be useful later, though. I'm sure of it. Okay. Now let's grab some plate. Okay, let me put my crafting table down for a sec. So many clay balls. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and turn this into that, and turn this into that. Okay, nice. We have so much. Dog, you better not drown. I'm gonna be so pissed if you drown. I will kill you if you drown. Alright, there we go. And we'll take you with me anyway. I know it's a bit strange to have, like... Oh god, we better get him out of here just in case. Come on, dog. 
Dog. Where's Dog? Gosh, these mushrooms are so tough to navigate around sometimes. Uh, fish, you, today's your lucky day. My inventory is pretty much full, so I'm not going to kill you today. I just really want a place to settle down. Uh, another cave looking place. Another cave looking place. I might live in a cave. Oh, well, hold on. It's a drop pod. Are you guys mean? They are mean. Okay. It's one of the drop pods. Out of here. There's one more. So yeah, these drop pods will appear from time to time. Uh, when you get a, um, a message like that, that means one of them has appeared somewhere. And um, hostile mobs will come out of them always. So be careful of that. It can be a bit tough at times. And oh wow, you guys are just nothing. Pathetic. Lava. Hold on. Actually, you know what? I don't really need the chip that much. I'm pretty sure I'll run into those guys later on. So I'm going to grab, get, get my hands on some lava, because that is a bit more rare. And there is a lot of lava here. Uh, I'm going to grab the sticks and cobblestone, and I'm just going to make myself two buckets. Because that's going to be used for the nether portal later. Awesome. So now... Oh, hello, friend. I'll be right with you. All right, now, wait, did I grab it? Oh, it's a little glitched out, okay. Oh, it's a brew fly. Okay, hold on. Where did it go? I don't want this thing messing with me. Get out, ow, 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 ow. Dog, no, careful dog, careful, it's next to lava. Ow. There we go. Okay, let's get out of here. I'm sick of this place. Oh, I should have some food ready. Uh, yeah, here we go. Alright, let's, uh, there's another drop pod over there. Hopefully, oh, they all drown, probably. Although the robots actually don't drown, so... They probably didn't drown. Okay. Cow. If you're lucky I'm suddenly vegetarian. I'm normally not a vegetarian, by the way, but for right now I am just because... Actually, I, I couldn't even say that. I'm holding meat in my hand as I say I'm a vegetarian. So, no, I'm not a vegetarian, not even in the game. Hello? Friend. Okay. Uh, I do kill them sometimes, but right now it kind of seems like it'd be a waste of my weapon's durability to kill the, the peaceful ones. I just don't like how they're watching me, huh? It's not really great. What's in here? There's a little cave in here. Hey there. I'm just gonna... Get out of here. And you too. Come on. There we go. Oop, I fell in there. I'd save the animals, but I am a bit selfish right now. I just want to sleep. Okay. Slept through another night without a home. So let's just get out of here. Oh, wow, look at that cave. There's a cave over here. Massive caves. Can't wait for that cave update, by the way. I know I'm a mod creator, but like, wow, that update looks really cool. Not to mention that, like, as someone who makes mods, like, having those updates is, like, kind of a big deal, you know? Like, everything changed when I got my hand, when we got our hands on the nether update. Though, at the moment, this mod is not updated, nether update. It's all the way up to the B update. Um,. Which is a bit unfortunate, but I am working on trying to update it right now. But at the moment, it is uh, it is not up to date. But like, I've already been working on a few things that like will work for the Nether, and with the update. So you know, as new updates come out, it's pretty cool. When I first started the mod, it was all the way up to the aquatic update. So having like the raid update, the, the uh, pillage and village update, village and pillage. And the B update, it's very cool to like have to work with that stuff. Um, so I'm really excited for the uh, for the cave update. The warden looks absolutely terrifying. I can't wait for that. Um, I don't really have any more wasteful. I guess I don't really need that much sand. I just like to hold on to it because also in villages, um, you can make a lot of money with sand by melting it. Hey 
basically once it is uh, once once you have it uh, smelted down the glass you can sell it to the uh, what are they called the the map guys the cartographers the cartographers uh, I make quite a bit of emeralds from that Man, I'm traveling so much I feel like I'm nowhere close to a village though Yay, more clay. Now I really want to find a village, because I can make so much money from this clay, I'm not even kidding. And having money is very useful. I can Now I can hire bodyguards, along with getting all the items I want. It's going to be very useful to have so much money. Okay. Oops, hold on. Uh, crafting table. Wait, I don't need a crafting... I'm so dumb, I don't need a crafting table for this. It's only four slots. God, why am I so dumb sometimes? Okay. There we go. 64 exactly, so... Probably would have to take another slot if I were to get more. For now, though... I just, oh, a ba oh, the Badlands. That's kind of cool. Uh, Badlands do have some stuff from my update. There's some... There's a few hostile mobs here. Alright, sorry for the interruption again. Uh, where was I? I was, uh, yeah, we're in the bad. Ow! Oh god! Oh god, that was bad. Are you okay? I don't think he fell when he teleported. Oh jeez. Okay, well we're in the Badlands now. And, uh, looks like... I haven't encountered it yet. There is a mod from my mod, though, and it spawns during the day. It has a little structure it stands by, usually. Hmm, I actually kind of want it just because they have some cool... Is there dolphins in the Badlands? That's so funny. Um, oh, is this like an ocean? That's kind of cool. Maybe we should get on the, get in the ocean and see if we can travel across. So, uh, yeah, their meat is very useful. There's a new food type that comes with this hostile mob. And it's actually quite useful when cooked. I'll show you what that is in a bit. Okay. Uh, is this the ocean? As the ocean's over here. And we didn't encounter that mob at all. I'm going to explore just a little bit, just because I do want to get that meat. Do I have enough? Yeah, I have enough. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. A bit of an important feature. Again, I haven't finished working on stuff, so I'm going to probably make it look better. But this is technically the location of the first boss. And I forgot that it can sometimes appear in a bad land. Uh, at the moment, it's just a uh, an egg. But I'm probably going to work on changing some things up. This is uh, technically the first boss of the mod. Um, and killing it will give you, at the moment, a few diamonds. I'm probably going to make it, give it uh, have a feature where it gives you some diamonds as well as something important for going to one of the new dimensions. Uh, but at the moment, all it does is give you diamonds. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to, we're going to have to sail. We're going to sail, buddy. We're gonna sail. Um, sailing is also a new bit of a problem in this mod because those stupid, those stupid mines over there will blow you up if your boat comes in contact with them. So you need to be careful. I will be careful. Uh, you just gotta have to watch the bubbles a little bit. If you see particles, probably means they're coming. Okay, get on the boat. All right, let's ride. Let's ride. Okay, we're gonna go across the ocean, and I want to find a village really badly. I'm working on adding some stuff to the ocean, but I might do that for a later update after the official release. Well, uh, that's another thing I really didn't mention. Uh, after the release of this mod, I will still be updating it, so it won't be complete. Uh, at this moment, it's still not even done. I'm still working on textures and animations. Um, but at the moment, oh, hold on. At the moment, uh, after the first release is over, I still have more plans. So if you guys like the mod enough, hey, okay, I'm going to keep working on it. There's going to be a lot of cool stuff added. Uh, I think with every major update, I plan on adding about seven bosses or so. At the moment of this video, I believe there are four. But I hope to release 
by the time that the official release is done to have seven bosses. Is that seriously another one? I, I swear these things were a bit more rare, but now I just have freaking two. Okay. And another one! Oh my god. Okay, so... Oh, that's another thing I have to improve. The first boss spawns a little too much in certain areas. I believe the reason we didn't run into it before is because we're in the wrong biome, but it looks like if you're in the right biome, sometimes they appear in beaches. So... I should probably make it more rare in beaches, because it looks like it's a little too common in beaches. Hello, friend. Okay, so I have two of these suckers, and they're actually really tough, by the way, the first boss. They, uh, I recommend you really have diamond armor. If you have iron, you can probably do it, but you really need a shield and to be extremely careful, because they are really, really, they hit really hard. Whoa, okay, hold on. Hold on, can I breathe? No, there's no air pockets. Give me a sec. I, there's a lot there. Hey buddies, you guys want to fight? You guys are not very good in water, by the way. So I gotta also fix the fact that the capture units are spawning in the middle of the ocean. That's not great. Oop, what is this? Island. Okay, wait here for a sec, dog. I'm gonna check. I'm pretty sure there's nothing here. This is a little small island, isn't it? Okay. That is true. Are you guys friendly? You're friendly. I'm gonna kill these stupid flies, though. It was another one. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, no sign of a village. It's a little frustrating. Die. Okay, one dead, and you also have to die now, and actually, I'm very close to being dead. I believe they do a little bit of damage. I'm sorry, I'm a little worried now. Do I have any cobblestone? I do not. I abandoned all my cobblestone. Get out of here. Get. Hey, dog, how you doing? There's a pig in the ocean. It's a pig in the ocean. What are you doing? What is this? The Badlands? I swear this is the same one. I'm going to be so pissed. Occasionally, um, after after you do certain tasks, certain achievements, certain uh, milestones, things will start to change in the overworld. And this is where I was before. What? Oh, no, 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 it isn't. No, it isn't. What is this? It's a mine shaft. And there's another one of those guys. Okay, you can get... You know what? Hold on. Just wait there for a sec. Okay, I think I want you to come with me because I'd be scared to go in there myself. And I got rid of the freaking torch. Damn it, I'm an idiot. Um, let's go ahead and make a chest. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to live here for a little bit. Just a little bit. I might leave some of the spawn eggs, actually, because they're kind of annoying. And, like, I don't know. It's not, at the moment, this isn't even how I want things to go. I'll keep the wolf one, of course, but, like, I don't, I don't want it to be like you have to carry these things around. I want it to look after you found a place to live. Okay, I'm back. I don't really want to talk about the atrocities I've just committed, but, um, anyways. Oh, I want that. I'm going to cook up some grub. Uh, and forget this ever happened. Did I eat raw rabbit? I can't remember. I think I did. I want to do it in case. Um, gosh. Dog, I'm gonna need you on this one. Get out of that boat. Hold on. Out of the boat. Oh, there's the ocean things. Oh god, oh, they're shooting at me. Yes, yeah, so like I said, there are some ocean enemies. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and kill it because it's really making me mad. Okay, you wait here for a sec. Just a sec. I'm gonna go in there. Yeah, there's these guys. They're the mirror dwellers. And they have a range projectile that you can't really see. The, I, work, I think I want to make an animation for these guys. The point is they're supposed to squint really hard and they create vacuums. That's at least what it's supposed to look like. Thank you for the achievement. Is there another one? Oh my god, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Okay, you are really annoying. Oh god. Stop. Are these things even damaging? Oh, there we go gonna say. Wasn't damaging my shield. I'm just gonna kill you the range thing, because you suck. Okay, give me a sec. I have this just for the occasion. Okay, come here. You want to play ranged? Aha, dead. And you can get their eye, which is currently sinking. Where is it? There it is. 
And uh, this, is, this is one of the items you can give the conspiracy theorists from before. They basically take uh, most loot from alien enemies, and uh, they will pay you for it. So you can get emeralds by, by getting loot from specific monsters. To prove that they aren't crazy, because they have discovered extraterrestrial life, and most villagers won't believe them, so you can help provide proof for them uh, by giving them this. But I'll show you that better when we find one of those guys. So my dog is still safe. I have two of these things, so I can get a few emeralds from that. Uh, we cooked up the mutton. Let's go ahead, cook up the rabbit. I'm probably going to head into that mine shaft. I don't know if I want to make this an episode thing, so you know what? I'm going to finish this video by exploring the mine shaft. If you guys want me to continue this, uh, then maybe if I could get like over, let's say 20 likes. If I get over 20 likes, I will continue uh, this series, exploring the mod I have created. But if you guys aren't interested, then uh, don't leave any likes. And hey, maybe if, uh, if this doesn't work out, you know, I get to leave this mod. But it's ultimately up to you guys if I should continue working on this mod or not. And of course the tricky part is I haven't even finished showing off all the mod stuff. There's a lot of mo there's a lot of stuff here. So I'm trying to get through it all, but it's very tricky. There's a lot of mobs you haven't encountered. There's dimensions and like bosses. Maybe I'll leave it off with the boss fight. That might be a good way to finish it. And here's some gold. Because a lot of what I'm playing right now is just vanilla Minecraft. But we encountered quite a few hostile mobs and yeah. And um <clears throat> I actually just wanted to make a long video in general, because you know what? This video is going to be long no matter what. So this is my video convincing you guys if you want me to continue this or not. Okay, food. Okay, I'm going to explore. Are you ready, dog? Are you ready? Hold on. I'm going to use the I'm going to use the wool for building, and then I'm going to leave most everything else. Okay. Also, the texture of the response isn't completely complete either. I was working on the texture. I made the model. I was working on the texture, but it didn't save. So now I have to do it again. So the texture isn't perfect. So maybe it's not like the best thing in the world, but I will still show it just so you guys can laugh at me. Um, but, 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 the boss uh, is programmed and it works perfectly well. Um, I might still have to add like an, a few animations for it because I want it to look cool. But at the moment, it works effectively well. It does its job, and it's... I think it's pretty challenging. Okay. Are you done cooking? Okay. We have quite a bit of food. There's a very low chance I might run into a conspiracy theorist in there, which is why I'm taking the, the, the Demir Dwell Eye with me. Um, I have so much wool. Okay, let's go in. Actually, let's do the mushrooms. I'm getting the mushrooms. I'm taking the cobblestone, of course. Okay. You, with me. Let's go. Uh, let's organize this a little bit. I'm not sure I can't stay in here. Okay. Alright, there we go. Okay, let's go ahead and explore. Maybe I get my hands on a few more diamonds, that'd be kind of nice. Ooh, gold. Gold, gold, gold. I have so much gold. I'm rich. That's off the track. Um, oh, here we go. I'm back on track. I'm hoping to find... How did you get over there? Is, this, is there an exit? Oh, those are the mobs from before I wanted to show you. Those are the... Oh, that's a... Oh, you're a... You're not a... You're not mine, are you? It's crazy. Okay. Oh, you must have come from that. Again, I gotta fix those things. Uh, that is if I continue making the mod. It's up to you guys. Yeah, these are the mobs I was trying to show you before. These are... Yeah, they kind of hang out in this hill. Unfortunately, it looks like the mod sometimes, since this technically might still count at the bottom... Yeah, it still technically counts. It's putting it in the middle of the water. Uh, I think there's a way to... I'm pretty sure I know how to fix that. Yeah, it's kind of a, a four-eyed uh, cow monster. And wow, they're coming for me. These guys are actually a little bit tough, but I will fight them. 
I have one shot. Okay, hold on. I really need my wolf. I want to fight them on land because it seems unfair to fight them the, while they're unable to move. Come on, guys. Over here. Maybe I'll fight them on the hill. Should I fight them? I'm going to fight them on the hill. This might be bad. I might actually die here. Oh, wow. Okay. Hold on. You know what? Don't worry about it, buddy. I got this. I'm going to beat all these guys. Oh, oh boy. Oh, boy. He's here. Okay. Alright, I'll fight you guys on your stupid hill. Get him, wolf. Get him. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. They're so fast. Oh god, there's too many of them. No, 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 no. Okay, I changed my mind. I changed my mind already. It's a terrible idea. Oh, oh, what's shooting at me? Oh, it's that stupid thing. Is my wolf still okay? It is. Because they're so focused on me, they're not even attacking him. And see, that's the purple meat I was telling you about. Alright. It's very useful when cooked. So I'm just gonna fight this guy. Yeah, even with iron armor, these guys hit really hard. Uh, and of course, finding them on their hill is kind of a bad, bad, not a good day for you. Because, um, there's so many of them. There's like a whole gang of them. Normally there's only like one at a time. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. So yeah, as you can see, you gotta be really careful with these things. They hit really hard. Um, so, you know, I've, I've seen that iron armor is about the lowest you should be to fight these things. Um, ooh, careful dog, you almost killed me. Uh, and the highest, there, there's, there are, there are, uh, there are mod armors that you can get that are better than diamond. Oh boy, oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, oh, it hit me so hard though. Kill him, he's, you not even focused on you. You can get him. I got this, I got this, there we go. Alright buddy, have some chicken. There we go buddy. Alright, I'm gonna fight these two fairly. Oh, that stupid dweller guy is really not doing me any favors right now. Oh, 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 he is, he is doing me some favors. Shoot him, shoot him. Heck yeah. You're killing the bad guys for me. Okay, there we go. You appear to be stuck, so I'm gonna deal with you very easily. Uh oh, I'm not going into him. Okay. And dead. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Well, it was actually awful and I was almost about to die. But, you know what? Doesn't matter. Semantics. Let's go ahead and head back. There's so many openings. I should start from a different point. Okay, so I did cheat a little bit. I did get my dog, though. My dog's right here. Uh, it was actually pretty close to the Badlands, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, I cheated a little bit just to get to here, and I found a really cool looking village actually. This looks really nice. I really love the bridge that connects to the Badlands. It's really cool. Uh, a little farming area here, pumpkins. Probably didn't need to carry all this dumb stuff. There's a cat here, some babies. Looks like there's a capture unit right over here. Some enemies there. Oh wait, I think they attack villagers. Crap, I'm gonna take care of that. Hold on. Oh, the drop out over here. Oh, crap. This village is actually a little bit of danger. Yeah, these things, I'm pretty sure, go for village. I know they try to kill golems. Okay. Alright, you guys gotta get out of here. I'm gonna save whatever creature is in here. Sheep. Hello there. And dead. Okay. Let him out. Let's let these guys out. Freedom, it's all yours. Okay. So with that out of the way, we pretty much... Hooray, we see the village. Okay, let's go ahead and find a place to stay. Or just, you know, build myself a house or something. Don't be lazy. But I'm feeling kind of lazy. I'm going to take this guy's house. Hello. A baby. Hello, baby. And I left the crafting table and everything. If I do, I just need I just need a chest, you know. Okay, let's just leave my chest right here. Okay, so now with this, I can make another furnace. With this and this, and if I remember correctly, uh, I need some more cobblestone. Uh, I can make a mason with just with the uh, the, the stone cutter, and that'll give me. A lot of room for money. I just need to make regular stone for the stone cutter. So let's put that in there. And then with this, 
for this baby. We can smelt all of this. And before I check out that villager, I'm going to finish uh, my farming job. Alright, that is that. So, now my farming job is done, I'm gonna get back to work on some other stuff. For one, I could fight the boss. After all, it would be kind of exciting, considering I haven't been able to do uh, everything. I haven't even found any of the biomes I created. There's a lot of stuff I still have to show. But uh, for now, and I could fight the first boss. It's, I could probably win. There's no iron golem in this place, I just realized. Not a single one. Alright, what's your guys' deal? What do you got? Okay. Oh, I didn't even check in here. Oh, look at all this obsidian! And a saddle. Oh my god, I'm lucky! That's enough to make the nether portal. I only need ten to make the nether portal. Oh my god, my luck. You, arrows. What's in here? Oh, you're just a Fletcher. That stinks. You even gave me flint and s flint, just regular flints. Oh my god, they just gave me a way to get to the nether. Oh my god, what are the chances? What is, what is this? Oh, it's a leather worker, okay. Fair enough. I actually don't have any use for these, do I? Uh, I might... I know there's like a way to give villagers armor. I believe if you like, use a... Uh, what's it called? The dispenser. And shoot it at them. I believe that you can make them equip, equip it. So maybe at some point I'll make them wear it. Just to keep them safe. Uh, nothing in here. Okay, well. I can literally go to the freaking nether now. And I do have some things in the nether that I added in my mod. Uh, not too much. I figured since the nether update's already so big, I decided not to add way too much. I don't want to disturb the balance too much. Um... But yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna make my thing. Okay. Add this and this. Any, any jobless people here? Oh my God! Anyone else besides these children? Anyone who doesn't have a job? Now everyone seems to have a job around here. Fantastic. Ah, uh, I'll come back. I'll, I'll, I'll just leave right here. Someone can grab the job later. And I should probably try and make the economy boom a little bit. You know, give the guy some money. Where are you do? What are you doing in here? Give me that. Yeah, we're friends now. Okay. With that, I'm gonna make a Nether portal. But before I go into the Nether, I'm gonna fight the first boss and die. That's the plan anyway. I'm probably gonna use this axe too. And I'm probably going to need some other stuff as well, including this meat. I'm going to need it cooked so I can show you guys what it does. So normally if I eat it, I'm going to leave one so I can show you what it does before I cook it. Let's go ahead and put down... Hold on. I have dirt, don't I? I have sand. That'll do. Uh, I'm going to smelt some sand, actually. I'm going to do that. Because soon I want to get a... Photographer. Okay, so yeah, let's cook this. Let's cook all this. Uh, I'm gonna need it for that boss fight. So I want to grow some sweet berries, actually. I'm, just, I'm gonna do this to the side here so nobody gets hurt. But I'm gonna have a supply. That's why I kept it for so long so I could have some sweet berries. I think that'll do. Oh, that's more. And I believe you can even use this kind of as a barricade. I'm gonna rid of that because I don't like how that's placed. Uh, you, you can use that kind of as a barricade, can't you? It'll be uh, it could be useful for some cases. I've never tried fighting the first boss with um, with that. I don't know how well that would work using sweet berries to try to stop him from moving. Okay, so I'm gonna take the pork. I'm gonna make the Nether portal now. Might as well. I'm gonna get to the edge of town. Right over here. I'm gonna grab some stone and then prepare for the fight. 
the first boss obviously it's not as strong as like the ender dragon but it is it's 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 it's, it's, it's tricky you know it's not easy um it mostly depends on your here we go your uh melee attacks it has to do with a lot with timing you have to like think fast but it's a much more it's not like a huge fight but it is kind of tricky also i have melons i should really i should really farm that i should really start farming melons There's also some alien fruits from this mod, but I haven't, we haven't really, we haven't been to the biome yet, so we can't really get our hands on that. Okay. How many is, I'm gonna plant some melons. I don't have any bones anymore, so no bone meal yet. Uh, but I wanna use bone meal eventually. So let's go ahead and put some melons. It's a good place for melons. This, this'll work. Two, three, and yeah, four, let's do that. All right, we got melons now, or we'll start to get them pretty soon. Um, okay, is this cooked yet? It's cooked. Yeah, it looks kind of, kind of, kind of burnt. But I thought, I thought the burnt look kind of. I, I like the burnt look, so I kind of kept it. Okay, I'm gonna leave this here. One of you, and uh, since the mod is incomplete, and right now their only reward is diamonds. Uh, fortunately, get out of the way, kid. <laughs> Get out of the way, kid. I'm just going to sleep in your bed. Uh, fortunately, this boss just gives me a bunch of diamonds. So, if anything, it's kind of it's going to be useful for me. All right, it's time to almost time to tango. I'm not 100% ready yet just because of one thing. I want to grab some I should really get a bow, honestly. I know like I made the slingshot and everything, but it's not the best weapon. It's just supposed to be really cheap and easy to use. But a bow would be preferred, if I'm being totally honest. But, you know what? It'll be fun. Oh, I don't want my wolf getting involved. The wolf will die, I'm very certain. Because I'm pretty sure uh, the mere dwellers from before and those uh, bull zerkers, those things that we fought, they aren't as hostile towards, like... They're very focused on you, but I'm pretty sure the first boss will kill anything that touches it during any fight. So I don't want him to die, so I'm going to do this one solo. Okay, well, wish me luck. This might end horribly. Okay, I'm going to do it out of town, because this thing will kill villagers too. They're specifically designed to kill villagers, and actually, they're also supposed to kill iron golems. Oh, I didn't finish... Uh, I didn't finish... There's one issue with this boss. Uh, wish me luck. I actually might die, so let's do this. So yeah, the texture is not done, unfortunately. Oh man, hold on. Okay, the texture's not done because it was deleted, so now it's just really weird and wonky. But the model is done, pretty much. Oh crap, okay, so this guy, yeah, he's not like, oh! I forgot he does so much damage. How did I get emeralds? Where did that come from? Okay, hold on. You stay back, okay. Oh, I might as well show what the meat does. Eating this meat will give you the resistance effect. Oh, which is very helpful. Oh, I forgot when he charges up. So this boss essentially is a giant robot that um, it has only really three, it has three attacks. It has the regular punch, um, which it will do from time to time. It's just, you know, melee, regular melee attacks. Um, then it, what it does, it'll charge up. And while it's charging up, it has a bit of a mini attack where if you touch it, it'll like push you back. It does very little damage, but it'll push you back. Of course, I still have to finish animating it as well. Uh, but then, yeah, the, right now it's charging. I want it to have like a charge animation. Um, but then when he finishes, he oh!